Hey, Allison Bales here with Energy Vanguard. Yesterday we had the demolition done, well, the first stage of demolition done for our basement renovation that is happening. And um, I found some really interesting things. Let me show you. Okay, this is one of the bathrooms in our basement and you can see what happened because of moisture. Moisture problems are of, of course common in basements. This is a 1961 house, so uh, 63 years old this year. And um, those studs are not touching the floor because the bottom plate completely rotted out. The mortar holding the tile up was holding the wall up as well. And so that's uh, that was a good discovery. I knew about that one because I demo uh, demoed the other side of it. Over here though, on the other side of the shower, same thing, bottom plate all rotted out. Right here, same thing, studs just hanging. And right here, this was something I discovered this morning. This is a wet spot on the floor because our upstairs bathroom, turns out the bathtub leaks. And that was a good discovery. More discoveries, same kind of thing. The, um, the framing is rotted in a lot of places all the way around. Uh, some of it, you can see, they have replaced some of the framing and sistered some studs on there. But notice, the bottom plates they used are not treated lumber. Here's another interesting discovery. I had seen the, uh, the little bit of that exposed red Georgia clay there uh, because the sheetrock didn't, didn't cover that whole hole. And I didn't know why that hole was there. Taking the sheetrock off, we discovered why. There's a uh, plumbing drain. This was not original to the house because that's ABS plastic, not cast iron, which is what most of the others are made of. And then there's the interesting electrical stuff. Of course, 63 year old house is gonna have a lot of that. This was a um, Romex cable buried behind sheetrock and the uh, wires are just taped together. I assume there's wire nuts in there. I haven't pulled the tape off yet, but this is, Definitely not up to code. Here, near that bath, uh, bathtub that's leaking down into the basement, we can see some wood framing. And this is, I'm not sure, this, this is not original framing to the house. So it's got some kind of microbial growth, it looks like, on it, with, uh, which, you know, not unusual for a, a wet basement. And one last thing, the, the two by fours that you see right in front of the, uh, me at the top of this video, we're holding sheetrock for the ceiling of this bathroom. And above the sheetrock is a pull chain light fixture. So that uh, was a little quirky discovery above the ceiling. So we have a lot of interesting stuff going on in our basement. The demolition is mostly done. I've got, I've got some more interior framing to remove and things like that and uh, chase down some of the electrical stuff, start working on that. But the, uh, the demolition is mostly done and uh, we've got a bunch of work left to do to get this renovation to the finish line. We've got plumbers coming to do some replacement of old cast iron pipes. We've got interior perimeter drain issues that we're gonna fix and then we're gonna get going on the framing and get this thing finished.